Pro users in 13.5 edition of Traction Waveform, there are some new updates. You may have seen it come out from the Traction software. Now the clip launcher has included a lot more features and the automation has improved even more. Now, I am a person that recently got into Traction Waveform and I created this channel to focus on exploring exactly how to use the DAW. I am getting to love the DAW and realizing that it is very complex, but it is also simple to use, but there are some things that are very complex as well. Can I show you something very simple, right? I just wanna show you how to use the clip launcher. All right, so the first thing I'm gonna do is I have this browser up here and I also have some tracks that I've created. I've created a drum track. I have track two, uh, which I'm not using right now. I have a guitar track and I have a bass guitar track. And the reason why I created these tracks is I know that I'm gonna put some type of drums or guitar or bass on these tracks. Now, what you would normally do is you would go through your browser and if you're looking for a sample, like for instance, if I'm looking for a sample, I might go down to funk and I might go to this West Coast. Now, in order to access the clip launcher, this is what you need to do. You need to press M on your keyboard and it's gonna bring up the mixer, okay? And over here to the right, you're gonna see, looks like little nine squares, kind of like a window basically. You're gonna click on that and that will allow you to open them up. If you don't see it, then you might just see the plug-in area, but if you click on it again, you should see these little slots. Now you can adjust these to the side. You can adjust the width of it, which is right here, to make it wider. You can adjust the height of it, depending on which way you want, but if you want to be able to see waves, you have to make sure that you have the height go on, expand it so that way you can see everything that's there. I added a drum clip this is a MIDI clip. I don't even remember where I got it from. It might've been from clips, been something like this. You just click on clips, drag it in, and then I can play this. Let's listen to it. Okay, notice, uh, notice that if you press play right here, it'll play that particular drum groove or whichever, okay? I don't really need this one because I added one in, so I'm gonna delete that. I'm gonna also stop this, press W to go back because I do have that drum groove up here and I really don't need it up here. Okay, so let's just do that. And now I can press play here. This is the groove I got. I can press stop down here to stop it. Okay, and it'll stop that particular clip. If I want to play everything within the scene, and I call this one scene because there's a master over here that you can see to the right. It says master, scene one, scene two, et cetera. Then I can press scene one and it should play all of them together. Okay, now. Now say I have it all the way that I really want it to be. I can actually record this straight into the project itself. I'm gonna make sure that I have everything set up. All right, and I'm going to enable scene one to play. All right, but I'm gonna press record first. So I'm gonna press R on the keyboard. All right. notice that it's actually recording right now. Okay, and I can stop it. I'm gonna press M and get rid of the mixer for a second. And then I can see these tracks right here and I can play it back. The bass, the guitar, and the drums, all right. This is my first time using the clip launcher. Yes, I know, I know. That's why I wanna share with you. This channel is all about exploring waveform. I'm learning just like you all are learning. So I hope this video helped. If you have any questions about what you did see, let me know in the comments. And like I said, if you use it, let me know how you use it. And is it easy to work? And do you enjoy using the clip launcher? Or would you prefer just to record everything out old school way? All right. 
This is your boy, Justin Norm. This is Waveform Explorer. Please subscribe to the channel. Click the notification bell so you're notified every time I post new content. Take care. Peace.